Let's go shopping in Barcelona. Upon a walk down Gran Via and Paseo de Gracia, I ran into a building owned by Zara. Zara is from Spain and I'm going to check out what they have in the men's section and I'll probably buy some stuff here at Zara. Zara originates from Spain and I found that they had a lot of unique clothing that I haven't seen in the US or in the Philippines yet. In this season, they were really pressing this vinyl pleather that was seemingly more breathable and more soft than any I'd ever found. By the way, 35 euro is pretty much $35. So not only are these choices not in the US market, but they're also more affordable. short I liked everything that I found here at Zara and Barcelona yo keep the fit y'all okay so that was dope now let's head out 30 minutes north of downtown to La Roca village to find some luxury designer brands on a discount Dude got a uh, belt because I needed a belt. I don't have anything. Uh, and this is not too flashy. It has the, the logo on it and I'm excited to wear it with jeans or a suit or whatever. But this store is amazing. Very cool, very casual. So near, blood in my mouth, handful of ass, handful of ass, mountains of cash. I fold it up like origami. Give me the paper, origami. I fold it up like origami. I eat it up like taco jacky. You know how I had to try them on. They see the drip. Eyes is on me, eyes is on me, eyes is on me, eyes is on me. I hold her up, she got a There's another one that we love, it's Etro. Not retro, but Etro. Take a look at this fit right here. Dang, bro. I can't see it. <laughs> here. Wow, look at those shoes. Very flamboyant boots with color in them. Joggers with the Etro insignia and the Paisley jacket. Bomber. How do you call that? That's the um, aviator bomber. The collar. Now, Etro is really known for these Paisleys and psychedelic patterns. Give me the paper. Little subdued detailing here. This is not your average prep outfit to be seen at the regatta, but it definitely fits down the runway, definitely fits down the red carpet. And we got smoker slippers with the insignia here. Loafers, bright red with the insignia. Wow, that is, that is better than Gucci. It's better than Ferragamo. Look at that. Yeah, I think that's men's. A little bit more basic here. Etro joggers with the perma crease. Right, right down the middle. Velour. With the animal print suit. 
Next door, Giuseppe. <laughs> this is so fabulous. Oh my God. Miami sunset. This is romantic. Texturized. Modern art here. Gold. Saints, what you know about them saints right here? Do you have this in one? Look at this. Oil spill right here, gasolina. Dang. That is incredible. Look at these sandals right here. Okay. Beautiful clunkers. Look at that dragon skin. Cobra Kai, they got a cobra on this. Wraps around the entire bottom. There's the, there, oh, he's got an eye. The eyeball. Wow, how wicked is this? With the fruit from the serpent. Now let's head back downtown and hit up Philip Pline. So bling bling. Oh. Really now? Look at the back. The skull insignia of blind. 3D printed bottoms. Python. So somehow this works for me. I don't know why, but <laughs> that is crazy. Bling. And that's about it for today. Thank you for shopping with me in Spain. Stay tuned for more episodes on delicious food in Barcelona, as well as some sightseeing and other fun things you might want to do here. If you like what you've seen in this video, please give it a like and subscribe to my content for more content just like this. And if you really feel generous, give it a share. Share it to your friends, man. Share it to your friends and family and get my views up. Thank you so much. I love you so much. Bye.